Hi guys, it's me, Grandma Lily, and that's right, it's time for story time with Grandma Lily. So, I hope you had a great day today. It was nice out. I got to go for a walk with the dogs. It wasn't raining. So, I hope you had a really great day today. Um, before we get started, let me say hello, and I love you to Elijah Jordan and Kylie, and a hello, and I love you to Serenity, all of my grandchildren. I hope you guys are all doing really great. I hope you all got to go outside for a little bit today. So sometimes, like I told you guys, I like to read special books for special people. So for example, um, one day Peyton, my little niece Peyton, asked me to read Green Eggs and Ham. So I did. And then my friend Brian, remember we read <coughs> uh, Fox in Socks for him for his birthday. So I have a friend and his name is Caden. And Caden turns 15 years old today. Today is Caden's birthday. And Caden, like everybody else, is not getting to go to school today. He's not getting to do his school play. He's missing out on conferences. And he can't have a really great birthday party with his friends because we're all stuck inside. So I asked Caden's mom what his favorite book was. Now, the first time that I went to see a show with Caden, I've known him since he was before he was even born. But the first time I went to see a show with him, he was about a year and a half old, and we went to see a show that my child Tyler was in at the time. And the show was called Susical the Musical. And if your parents have time, tell them to go look it up on YouTube and sit you down to watch it. It's a lot of fun. Anyway, so I asked Faith, who is Caden's mom, Miss Faith, what Caden's favorite Dr. Seuss, Dr. Seuss book was. And actually, Caden's favorite book when he was little was not actually Dr. Seuss, but it was part of the Dr. Seuss I Can Read All By Myself collection. Dr. Seuss had some books put together that were for kids that could learn to read all by themselves. They had short words and not a lot of words. And in this case, Caden's book, favorite book, was Go Dog Go. So today, in honor of Caden's birthday, we are going to say happy birthday, Caden, and we are going to read Go Dog Go. So here we go. Go Dog Go. And this book is by P.D. Eastman. To Clooney. Remember I told you that everybody dedicates their books? I don't know who Clooney is, but that is who this book is dedicated to. Dog. Big dog. Little dog. Big dogs and little dogs. Black and white dogs. Look at all those dogs. One little dog going in. Three big dogs going out. You know who that looks like? Have you ever seen that book about book about Clifford the Big Red Dog? Kind of looks like Clifford, doesn't it? A red dog on a blue tree. A blue dog on a red tree. A green dog on a yellow tree. Some big dogs and some little dogs going around in cars. A dog out of a car. Uh-oh. Looks like there's something wrong with that dog's car. Two big dogs going up. One little dog going down. Do you like roller? I love roller coasters. Do you like roller coasters? One dog up on a house. Three dogs down in the water. A green dog over a tree. A yellow dog under a tree. Whereas the green dog is flying a helicopter and the yellow dog is in a hammock reading a book. I wonder if the yellow dog is reading Go Dog Go. Two dogs in a house, in, on a boat, in the water. A dog over the water, a dog under the water. Hello again. Hello. Do you like my hat? I do not like it. Goodbye again. Goodbye. I don't know. I kind of like the hat. Don't you like that? The dogs are all going round and around and around. Go around again. Go around again. 
Did you ever yell that when you were on a, on a merry-go-round or a Ferris wheel that they, you wanted them to go around again? It is hot out here in the sun. The sun is up. The sun is yellow. The yellow sun is over the house. It is not hot here under the house. Now it is night. Three dogs at a party on a boat at night. Dogs at work. Work, dogs, work. Dogs at play. Play, dogs, play. Hello again. Hello. Do you like my hat? I do not like that hat. Goodbye again. Goodbye. Dogs and cars again. Going away. Going away fast. Look at those dogs go. Go, dog, go. Stop, dog, stop. The light is red now. We don't want the dog to hit the bird, do we? Go, dogs, go. The light is green now. Two dogs at play, at play up on top. Go down, dogs. Do not play up there. Go down. Now it is night. Night is not a time for play. It is time for sleep. The dogs go to sleep. They will sleep all night. I don't know about you, but my dogs sleep all day too. Now it is day. The sun is up. Now is the time for all dogs to get up. Get up. It is day. Time to get going. Go, dogs, go. There they go. Look at those dogs go. Why are they going fast in those cars? What are they going to do? Where are those dogs going? Look where they are going. They are all going to that big tree over there. Now the cars stop. Now all the dogs get out. And now look where those dogs are going. To the tree, to the tree. Up the tree, up the tree. Up they go to the top of the tree. Why? Will they work there? Will they play there? What is up there on top of that tree? A dog party, a big dog party. Big dogs, little dogs, red dogs, blue dogs, black dogs, and white dogs are all at a dog party. What a dog party. Hello again. And now, do you like my hat? I do. What a hat. I like it. I like that party hat. That's a pretty cool looking hat. Ah. Goodbye. Goodbye. The end. And that, boys and girls, kids, that is Go Dog Go by P.D. Eastman. And that is one of Dr. Seuss's I Can Read It All By Myself books. So when you guys get a chance, if your moms and dads have it, or if they can get it, pick up a copy of Go Dog Go, and you can learn how to read. That's it for today. Grandma Lily says goodbye, and I love you all, and I will see you all tomorrow with another story. Bye-bye now. Mwah.